Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing The Sims 4. And if you missed the last episode, to sum it up, my son died, as well as many other people. I assume that's what Jim was cleaning up, just the blood <laughs> on the front porch. I don't know why he's wearing this bear outfit now, I guess just to hide his emotions. Could you change it to something else, please? Much better. Oh, she's gone into labor! Look, I just don't care. <laughs> what we want to focus on now is that my son's grave seems to be acting up. No, that wrong one. That's another woman. <laughs> I don't think you ever even spoke to her, actually. All right, so we'll Chant boy's name, which would just be standing there going, first name, first name, first name. <laughs> it looks like he's giving out to him. Did I give you permission to die? <laughs> I don't think so. Well, what the hell? Oh my god, he actually came up with sunglasses on. <laughs> oh my god, he looks so fecked. I like how he actually came up where first name died as well. He died like around this circle somewhere. Oh, he's like the Terminator. Boy, he looks cool. <laughs> Oh, why are you kicking my child? What the hell was that? Everyone else is freaking out and he just kicked him. Okay, now he's freaking out. He's realized that his reaction wasn't really in tune with what, what everyone else is thinking. First name never looks so cool. Wait, what? Is that second for second name? Oh, oh god. All right. That's concerning. <laughs> Oh my god, it's like the baby head out of Toy Story. Don't tell me there's another one. <laughs> Let's capture this moment. Even Jim is like, wait, are all my children coming back? Okay, this is starting to get ridiculous. Like, at least the other ones disappear. <laughs> oh, now the robot's kicking him. Okay, this is one of the strangest situations I've ever found myself in The Sims 4, and that's saying a lot. I'm just gonna speed through this and just see what ha- Oh, okay, someone is getting attacked. Okay, I think this is the one we're getting stuck with. I Why doesn't he wear sunglasses? Hold on, let's see if we can dress him up a bit modify yes <laughs> i'm gonna make him wear sunglasses and make him really pretty okay that is not how he looks <laughs> it's like me in the mirror versus me in pictures <laughs> i think he's broken my robot my robot's freaking out oh my jesus christ what is he doing now <laughs> i thought first name was as cursed as you could get but no this is way worse do you think this is what jk rowling had in her mind when she made harry potter and the cursed child why is my dad drinking for me in the background <laughs> i was so focused on this that i didn't notice this how can you even suck on blood? You're a ghost. Oh my god. Did that kid just kill Santa Claus? Dude, you ruined Christmas. You're the worst kid ever. Oh my god, what are you doing to them now? Okay. Well, he's dying. <laughs> that is terrifying. Shrek is asleep. This is all boring to him. Here comes the Grim Reaper to clean it all up. Don't worry, with death comes birth. It's the circle of life. What was his name again? It was George something. I'll just make him again. <laughs> it's also a girl, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I got the name right anyway. Mom. Um, Dad, why did you call me George Cahill when that's a boy's name? And also, it isn't your second name? Well, I don't know, honey. The name just kind of opened up. It was convenient. Oh, for feck's sake, he's back. Why does he keep changing every time he comes back? Oh, great. And now he's also doing this. <laughs> oh my god, now he's killing someone else. Everyone is going to be dead in about five minutes. At least my dad is getting a good sleep. He's not really worried since, you know, he's already dead. And Jim is also going to get some sleep. <laughs> Nap time. Uh, something's wrong with the kid. Can someone put him to bed or something? Body physique. I'm really tempted to go messing with him. You know what? I'll save my game and then I'll go messing with them because I, I think it's a bit dangerous. Oh great, there's another one. They keep coming. They don't stop coming and they don't stop coming like the great prophet Shrek said. They finally get the picture to just run away though. Simeon says congratulations on the new addition to the family. Is he talking about this? Because if so, yeah, I think he's being sarcastic. Wait, this stranger just came up and is kicking my kid and now the other one is killing her for it. Oh my god! He made her into an instant ghost and now the dog has no owner. He's just walking away with stars around his head, confused Confused. I don't blame him. Wait, what the hell? Okay, he just took the soul out of this woman. And Mole. Mole is now also dead. Okay, this is going too far. Oh my god, now a stranger is dying. Everything's going to hell. Yeah, don't mess with Grim. He is literally undead. He is far more controlled than you do. In fact, Grim, banish him for doing that. There you go. You see, Grim Reaper is really in control. I don't think you understand the power in this family. Like, the Grim Reaper... Jim Pickens, Shrek. <laughs> uh, sorry you had to die before all that went down. That That is grisly, Jesus Christ. Oh yeah, I forgot there's another one in the tunnel. Can you get rid of him as well? Okay, he's literally blocking our way home. He's the troll under the bridge. Could you stop? <laughs> we can't get past him. Okay, I think he's being banished or else he got hit by a car. Same thing. Thanks, Grim. I, I don't think we need you for now. God, we lost a lot of people today. I'll just put out some of the gravestones, add them to the graveyard. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I think I'm playing The Sims wrong. <laughs> and if this was like one long household, I had fair enough. But I've only been in this house for like two episodes. I wish I had a total kill count, honestly. Okay, I wonder how can I do this? How can I summon him and like contain his power? Because I can't just abandon my child again. <laughs> well,
Well, George Cahill, your mom died. I'm sorry about that. But no worries. You'll probably be taken away anyway. Wait, what the hell? Jesus Christ. Someone stop that dog. Robot, come on. You're just looking at him doing that? No wonder he's so sick. Okay, let's try this again. We're gonna summon him, and then we're gonna try and lock him in a room of some sort. That won't make him angry. We'll try and calm him down. Why do so many dog walkers come around here? <laughs> so many of them have died, but they keep coming. Okay, he's here. Now, everyone just leave. Oh, it's the sunglasses one. He's the cool one. Get out of his way. Everyone just leave. Stop giving him attention. He feeds off it. Due to neglect, unwelcome is being whisked away to safety. <laughs> he just gets beamed up into the sky. What about the rest of us? None of us are safe. Jesus Christ, that is such a mess. I love it. Okay, he's killing another dog walker. Uh, like, at this point, I don't really have any sympathy. Okay, you didn't do anything to be- Or you- uh, Sorry. <laughs> Look, maybe you should just go- <laughs> Alright, it might be a bit too late. Lady, this is the part where you run away, <laughs> as the famous prophet Shrek said. Okay, now he's killing this guy too. Oh my god, he's gonna kill feckin' everyone. I'm just trying to lock him up. Who could control this? Should I call a nanny? Can a nanny solve this problem? Maybe I can go on one of those TV shows. All right, hire a service, where is it? There we go, a nanny can solve this problem, like a really good one. Nanny, yes. All right, Nanny, you got here just in time. Thank God. Maybe you can control this situation. That's right, Jim. Kick your child. You're the only one who can stop this. Oh, well, the dog is back. Why are all the dogs attracted to blood? Oh, the Nanny's dead. For feck's sake. Oh, this is pointless. Now he's attacking my robot. Good thing I don't think the robot can actually die. I don't know how you're getting blood out of it. It's like that old saying. You can't get blood out of a stone, but you can get blood out of a robot. Don't point at it. You'll piss it off. I'm just trying to get it on the lot so I can actually... Oh, it disappeared. It did all that damage and then it's just feckin' disappeared. That was the best nanny I ever had. And now he's gone. <laughs> what a day of work. Kabir is back home and he has earned $4,000. At least someone had a good day. Well, add seven more graves to the garden. Okay, I'm gonna try one more thing. I'm gonna try and forcibly add him to the family. Alright, don't kill anyone, don't kill anyone. I I'm afraid this is gonna break my game. Okay, add to family. He's very tense. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> okay, I can control him. Great. Wait, what does he have here? Grade school homework. Okay, it's an important step toward getting good grades, apparently. Okay, I was gonna lock the door, but you know what? No, just feckin' delete the door. <laughs> I don't trust him even with a locked door. He'll get out. Yeah. What the hell is he doing? All right. This is definitely a good idea, to trap this cursed child inside a little box. Now at least we can see what he's doing in there. Oh my god, I don't think he's too happy about this. Jesus Christ almighty, look at that, that is so scary. Can I light him on fire? Is my magic any good against him? Oh, this isn't gonna make him happy, is it? Oh good, I've set the cursed child on fire. <laughs> the ghost comes through to panic. It's like he just murdered you, I don't think you'd be panicking, I think you'd be celebrating. Oh, don't worry, my dad's here to extinguish him. <sighs> He's been just murdered like 15 people and then my ghost dad comes through like, Don't worry, grandson, I'm coming! <laughs> and then he kicks him. <laughs> to top off everything, he fucking kicks him! Alright, ghost dad, can you go away? I'm actively trying to kill the ghost of my son. And I'll happily kill the ghost of my dad if you get in the way. Okay, good, we got him on fire again. They're panicking to try and get in. Why would he be bothered? The disturbing thing is he doesn't seem to even care. He seems kind of bored. Yeah, this isn't affecting him in the slightest. He's discovered the fire and he's going putting it out. Probably for the best, it didn't seem to be doing anything. All right, if fire doesn't work, maybe a pool will. <laughs> My years of sim torture is really paying off here. Okay, yeah, get in the pool. Okay, fantastic. Now we'll just close up that wall. <laughs> it's becoming an interesting little man cave out here, isn't it? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, I think it's made the bats angry. My ghost dad is just showering in front of the window. Oh, he's also crying. Is it really crying? If you're crying in the shower, though, you can't see the tears. Okay, I think I'm just relaxing him. It's not affecting his mood at all. <laughs> he's just getting happiness from fun. What to do, what to do. <laughs> can't even Google it because my browser history would be extremely suspect. Wait, is he dying? Nope. No, he's not. Oh, it's rebate day. Good. He's excited for it. <laughs> I could try forcibly aging him up and seeing what happens. This could break my game. Go for it. Okay, I don't think it works. That's probably for the best. It probably would have just exploded my entire save file. God, what's he doing now? Oh, okay, it doesn't matter. <laughs> His grandpa knocked him out of it. Oh, I aged him up. Good, good, good. Wow, you grew up into like an actual human. Oh, no, you didn't. <laughs> twerking why is he twerking oh this whole episode is so fact it's just extremely cursed he likes it though all right let's age him up again <laughs> This is so fact. Oh no, no, I aged him down again. Oh no, I'm really messing with him now. Oh no, oh no, stop, 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 stop. What is happening? Okay, he's aged stuff again. <laughs> this is torture. God, all his bones are breaking. Okay, he's in adulthood now. Oh, a bit of a growth spurt there. I think he's okay again. Oh no, 
Oh no, oh no, he doesn't like being an elder. Look, uh, son, I think it's uh, time for you to get your own space now, by which I mean we we will leave. You, you can have this place. The whole place is cursed. Yeah, feck it. We're going to the vault, folks. We may have lost, uh, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 20, 25 people, but I won't lose anymore. <laughs> I'm a good leader. <laughs> okay, yeah, he's having a moment. Every, everyone just leave. Everyone leave while he's having his moment. Jim has slept through the whole thing. <laughs> okay, take them all, and uh, you can keep the baby. That's fine. <laughs> That's better than negotiation. Uh, the, the money's mine, though. Like, you, you get the baby, I get the money. Like, if I ask someone, can I buy your baby? They'd probably be like, no. I'd say like 270,000. They'd probably still be like, no. I, I think it's a decent deal. I'm literally selling you my baby for a quarter of a mil. That's, that's chump change. Like for a baby, you know? Like some people would say they're priceless. I, I'm doing them a favor. I, look how happy he is now. <laughs> okay, good. Now, uh, before he comes to get us, everyone get down in the vault. There we go. Here's my vault. I've already decorated it. I didn't build a vault. I got it on the gallery, but I got lots of DLC so I can put in, um, well, it's just custom content. A lot of Fallout related things. We got like Mr. Handy there. We got the little bear and the, the bedside table and Wow, just lots of stuff. Look, look at that. It's Mr. Jingles or whatever his name is. I can't remember. Okay, everyone's in the vault. Now I lock the door for everyone but Jim so he can get in and out and he can enjoy the Fallout 4 starter house <laughs> all to himself. Oh, look at that. That is beautiful. You look great. That's right. Even my ghost dad has to wear this. It's vault attire. Oh my god, that's a bit too skin tight for my comfort. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm wearing a Darth Vader suit kind of suits, I guess, since he's like the leader. <laughs> All right, perfect. All my subjects are dressed up, except Grim, who's refusing. He's wearing his suit. He's crying at his new life. All right, well, I think we might end it there. That is enough damage done for one day. Ah, I love my job. <laughs> All right, yeah, we will end it there. I hope you enjoyed, though. I know I did, which is kind of disturbing. Uh, I appreciate you watching, as always, folks, and I do hope to see you next time. Bye for now.